Hey everyone, Marcel here. Guys, welcome back to my kitchen. Today I'm sharing a little bit of an oldie but a goodie recipe with you. I'm gonna show you how I make these delicious sour cream chocolate chip muffins. Um, this recipe has been on the pages of my blog since April of 2016. Um, it's really hard to believe it's been that long, but I used to make these muffins all the time for like a quick little family treat. It's kind of fallen off our radar for a while, but I made a batch over the weekend and they got gobbled up. And I know this old recipe has stood the test of time, at least with my family. Um, I had a request come in for a second batch already for after school snacks. And I thought I would hop on and show you how to make these as well. So anyway, there's a very simple recipe guys, but they are an absolutely delicious treat for any time of the day. So, all right. Let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna show you this short list of ingredients for these delicious sour cream chocolate chip muffins. Alrighty y'all, so here are the super simple ingredients um, that will go into these delicious sour cream chocolate chip muffins. Here I have one and three quarter cup of some self-rising flour. Okay, then we're gonna need half a cup of white sugar, a couple teaspoons of vanilla extract. I have a cup of sour cream here one full cup eight ounces of sour cream you guys we will need a half cup measure of some chocolate chips and you can use any type of chocolate chip you want to make these today i have some full size milk chocolate chips very typically i use the mini semi-sweet um, but milk chocolate the sweetness sounds good to me today so that's what we're rolling with and then here I have one third cup of vegetable oil. You could also use butter, guys, one third cup. I have a half cup of milk and one large egg. That is it for the ingredients. The oven is preheating to 400 degrees, you guys. And then I have this awesome silicone coated muffin tin that I have just fallen madly in love with. I found this at my store not too long ago. If you want to check one out for yourself, I don't know if I can find this exact one, but I'll link one like it um, that I find on Amazon if you want to check it out. It's really been a game changer uh, with the uh, silicone coating. But anyway, guys, all right, let's get this um, wet mixture put together. We're going into this bowl. Okay guys, so here's our delicious sour cream chocolate chip muffin batter. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna use an ice cream scooper to fill these up um, two thirds full, so pretty full. 
And then I'm going to be topping them just like I do all my little baked goodies that I'm not adding a streusel topping to or a glaze to. I'm going to add my sparkling sugar. It gives it just a nice little sparkle and some crunch on the top and I just love it to pieces. So, all right, we're going to get these ready to roll here. Okay guys, so this recipe makes exactly one dozen muffins, standard muffins. Of course, you can do this at these as little mini muffins. Um, you just have to play with the amounts. Now I'm going back and any of these that ended up that didn't have some little chocolate chips on top, <laughs> I'm just kind of planting them there, you know, for that, that glamour effect. And then we're gonna go over with our sparkling sugar. Just a little sprinkle. Okay guys, so here's what they look like right before they go in the oven. And I will show you what they look like fresh out of the oven in about 18 to 20 minutes. Okay everybody, so here are these fantastical sour cream chocolate chip muffins right out of the oven. My whole house smells just heavenly, you guys. Trust me, we are ready to grab one of these muffins, but they need to cool for about 15 to 20 minutes because they are crazy hot right now. I did let these go actually for 21 minutes because at 20 minutes, they just weren't as uh, toasty looking on the top as I wanted them to be. So keep that in mind, just let them go, you know, one minute at a time to get them as golden brown as you want them to be. But they are perfect. And I'm um, going to give them about 15 minutes to cool down. And trust me, we are ready to dig into these delicious muffins. Okay, guys. So the muffins have cooled down enough. And uh, we can handle these suckers now. So I have a special guest for this part. Come here. My daughter is home with me today, and she wanted to taste test these with me. Um, so we are gonna we are gonna dig in here. Here they are. One last look. Which one do you want? Dibs. Okay, I want to take. I did. Well, let's see. We might. Do we have to pop it out? I want it. Got it. Mm. All right. So I'm gonna grab mine. Man, okay, the screen. Trying to tear up my uh, screen door back there. All right, ready? Let's cheers. Cheery. Ready? Cheers. All right, I'm gonna tear it open so you guys can see. Yummy. What do you think, Em? Did they give them a try? Sure. <laughs> Love the enthusiasm there. <laughs> All right, guys, well, let me know what you think if you give these a try. I'd love to hear what you think about the recipe and any ways you change it to make it your own, as always. Um, but that's it for this recipe. We are gonna go enjoy our muffins. I've got a fresh cup of coffee here to uh, enjoy with mine. As always, thanks for watching, guys. Take care out there. I'll see you real, real soon in the next video. You say bye? Bye. bye. We got our cabin.